Aloha, Sandra Razielli here for day 11 of Kiss My Asana. Today I'm at the campus of the University of Hawaii. Behind me is a really huge mural celebrating the time of Makahiki, which is a time of peace where people eat, play games, spend time together in social environments. You can see a little bit of that. I'll pan on the mural after we're done with our pose of the day, which is going to be warrior two, warrior during a time of peace. So to get there, take your legs wide and let's turn your, it's April, so turn the right leg in, left leg out and come back and forth a few times to open up the hips. So we're not gonna jump right into the pose, I'm gonna build the pose a little bit. So start by bending and straightening your front leg. Breathing as you bend the leg, can you keep your spine long? So notice that as I'm bending my leg, I'm not taking my torso with me. I'm just keeping my spine long, up and down a few times. And then let's switch directions, or left leg in, right leg out. Go ahead and bend and straighten a few times. Again, spine stays long. And as you bend and straighten, you might find that you want to take your feet a little wider, you'll get a little lower, or you might want to bring them a little closer. Your choice. What, find what feels good, what feels balanced. So in this pose, finding that balance of the strength and fluidity, sense of forcefulness and peace. Let's take a moment before you go back to the knees bent, come back into big asana. Take your arms wide. Remember this from I think day one or day two. Roll your arms so your palms face up towards the seat feeling or the sky and then go ahead and turn your head to look out over your left arm and just reach through your pinky finger come back to center turn your head to look over the left right arm reach through your pinky finger notice did your shoulders come up by your ears if you did take them down and then go ahead and bend your elbows still preparing getting our back ready to hold up our arms for warrior turn your head to the left Again, elbow in line with your shoulder. Come back to center. Turn your head to the right, elbow in line with shoulder. Good. Then release your arms down, roll your shoulders a few times. All right, let's put these together for Virabhadrasana 2, Warrior 2. Turn your right leg in, turn the left leg out. Next inhalation, take your arms on up. Reach the shoulder blades wide, reach through your pinky finger. Another inhalation, lengthening up. As you exhale, bend the front knee. Find a position that you are comfortable holding for a few breaths and look out over your left arm. So even while you're holding the pose, it's not necessarily static or stagnant. You might root down a little bit more with the back leg, the back foot, but that outer edge of your right ankle, you might feel or lift your toes on the left foot. Root down at the base of the toes, the heels. Reach long through the arms. Bring the toes on down. Ha! Ah. Breathe. Okay, and then come up to the other side. You might keep your arms up or you might take them down. Shift the legs. Left leg in or right leg out. Reach out nice and long through the arms. On your exhalation, bend the front knee. Again, feeling. Where you go in the pose, where does it feel a sense of balance that you can have your bones support the muscles, that you can look out over your right arm, reach through the left arm. I know sometimes I drop my back arm when I'm in this pose, rooting down with the feet, lengthening up with the spine, and breathing. Okay, and then to come up, feel that back leg. Straighten the front leg, hands to the hips, turn your leg in, walk your feet together. Take a moment, feel the reverberation of a warrior. And thanks for watching, Kiss My Asana Day 11. If you stay just a moment longer, I'll pan for you the mural. You can see a talk, you can see 
the soldiers, the warriors, the king chief, and then the abundant fish, the waterfall. I don't know if you can see on the edge, there's some of the games they play during this, the Makahiki time. All right, thanks for watching. Till tomorrow.